Hi everybody, my name is Jennifer Beard and I'm an Assistive Technology Specialist with Fulton County Schools. Hey, did you know that in addition to reading web pages out loud, Read Out Loud 6, one of the components of Solo 6 Literacy Suite software, will also read eText out loud, which is this button right here. Add eText. Let's say you have a test that you have created in Microsoft Word. Well, you can convert that to a PDF or a rich text format and then add it as an e-text document here in Read Out Loud. And students can use the Read Out Loud software to read that content out loud to them. So let's jump right in and show you how to do that. All right, the first thing that I have is a reading passage that I have in Microsoft Word. And in order to actually add this into Read Out Loud as an e-text, I have to convert it to either a PDF or an RTF, which stands for Rich Text Format. It's very simple for me to do this. All I have to do is go to File, click on Save As. Then I need to point my computer to where I want it to be saved. So we'll go right into the same folder where I have the Word document saved. Okay, here's where you have to make the change. Underneath Save as Type, you need to click on this drop down menu. And here is where you can either choose to change it into a rich text format, which will give it a .rtf file extension or a PDF. So either one that you choose is fine. Rich text format, if you choose that option, that is going to maintain the word by word highlighting as students use the text to speech feature. Each word will be highlighted as it's read out loud to them. However, the con of rich text format is that it will not maintain the formatting of your document. So if you have a document that has, let's say, charts or graphs or a map, an image, or if you have columns that you have to maintain the integrity of those columns, Columns. let's say it's a test and you have a matching section or something like that rich text format is not going to maintain that formatting for you so if that's the case you're going to want to go with PDF PDF will maintain the integrity of the document so those are your two options I could save as PDF or I could save as a rich text format so for the purposes of this example I'll go ahead and save this document as a rich text format you can see now that I have rich text format selected as save as type and I'm going to go ahead and click save. Now I have a rich text format copy of this document saved in the same file. The other thing I want to show you is that I can do the same thing with a PowerPoint presentation. So I can take this PowerPoint presentation that my students may want to review. I can click on file and go through the exact same process. Save as point to where I want it to be saved on the computer and then under save as type I can select once again PDF so PDF is the only option that I'm going to have to save a PowerPoint or I could choose an outline version RTF but I want to maintain the integrity of my PowerPoint so I'm going to go ahead and click PDF in this case and I'm going to click save Okay, once I've done that, I can add either or both of my files into Read Out Loud and have it read out loud for my students. So the way that I'm going to do that is add by e clicking on Add eText. I'm going to point to where that document is located on my computer. Okay, so here's the PDF version of my PowerPoint presentation. So I can go ahead and select that and click Open. And now it will open for me in Read Out Loud, and I can click the Speak, Speak. icon. Economic Systems All economic systems seek to answer the three basic eco I can also add another e-text, so I'm going to click on my Add e-text button again. Add e-text. And this time I'm going to find my RTF document that I saved my rich text format here it is I can tell it's rich text format because over here under type it says rich text format so I'm gonna select that and click open I can have it speak. read this out loud as well by clicking on my speak icon Israel's dirty water Neil G line back geography in the news Israel unquestionably the Middle East's most 
So there you go. That's how you convert documents or PowerPoints that you already have into e-text versions that are going to be compatible with Read Out Loud. You're going to have to convert either to a PDF or to an RTF format. It's very easy to do so. You just go to File, Save As, and you change Save As Type. Then you can add it as e-text into Read Out Loud. I hope you found this video tutorial helpful. Please let us know if you have any questions.